Amen. That's wonderful. That's good. I'm going to invite Dr. Lind to share a testimony from her sister who God did a miracle. Uh, Amen. 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 This is this is a testimony of healing and deliverance from South Africa. Amen. And the sister wrote, Dear Prophetess Christine, greetings to you in Jesus' name. My name is Sister So and So from South Africa. Last night I requested prayer for my daughter. You prayed with me for my daughter. She was falsely accused by the police. This case was going on for eight months. This was an obstacle for my daughter who is a qualified lawyer. This conviction was pre preventing her from getting employment and she could not go overseas. This morning, my daughter woke up feeling different after a very long time. She said she feels peace and feels um, felt healing. She dreamt of a man chopping a huge snake which was coming to attack her. That's healing. This afternoon, the attorney phoned to say that the documents of conviction will be sent to the criminal bureau on Monday. The convictions will be expunged. Praise God. Amen. Thank God for Prophetess Christine. You are a true servant of God. You asked me to phone you and tell you how she felt today. My daughter is healed in Jesus' name. Amen. She feels she is back in her true senses after a long time. Amen. This witchcraft was over her life from a little child. Today she is healed. She is now 35 years old. From now, all obstacles will be removed. Prophetess Christine, please continue to pray uh, for my daughter and my family, my husband, son, and myself. God bless and season's greetings, sister in South Africa. Amen. 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 Yeah, we thank Amen. God for the testimony. Amen. Yes. Uh, yours is coming. Yours is coming. Let's pray to see this testimony. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I seal the prayer and the testimony with the blood of Jesus. Father, no one will be attempted, no one will be uh, uh, affected because of the testimony and, uh, and the prayer. Father, we seal this prayer. We seal this prayer with the precious blood. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. Thank you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. I want to welcome all of you once again. Thank you for coming. Uh, God bless you. I welcome first timers. Welcome once again. Thank you. This is Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. Uh, we are here to. Um, um, today I'm, I'm teaching about the prayer and uh, how the prayer works. How you can access God direct. How you can uh, you, uh, how you can get direct. How you can get direct to God. How you can access God direct. Welcome once again. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Father, I want to thank you. I want to bless your name. I give all the glory. I give all the honor in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You are a great God. We love you. We worship you. We honor you. We welcome your presence. We welcome you, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isiki. Welcome you from Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The topic I'm going to talk is called How to Get Direct Access to God by Fire. I'm using by fire because that is what I was given. How to get direct access to God by fire. How do you get access? How do you get direct access to God? How to get direct access to God? The Bible says, Dr. Rindy, open your Bible from the book of Ephesians 2, verse 18 to 21. Amen. 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 
God is good. Hallelujah. Yes. Ephesians 2, verse 18. Yes. For through him, we both have access by one spirit to the Father. Now, therefore, you are no longer... I'm sorry. Now, therefore, you are no longer strangers and foreigners, but fellow citizens with the saints and members of the household of God having been built on the foundation of the apostles and prophets, Jesus Christ himself being the chief cornerstone, in whom the whole building, being fitted together, grows into a holy temple in the Lord. Amen. For through him we both have access to the Father by one spirit. You know, there is access Access means, what does access mean? Can some police share with me? It's the ability to get into something. It's the ability to get to someone. Yes. To access, like now, if I gave you the prayer line without access code number, you can't enter. <laughs> That's a good example. <laughs> That's a very good example. So we, we can have everything, but without the access, we can't enter. And the access, by, by the Bible says, for through him we both have access to the Father by one spirit. The access is one spirit, the spirit of God that we have. It is, that is the access we have. Everyone has access, but some people, they don't have access. They can't go through. They can't go directly through God. So we, we want to go, we want to, to pray the prayer that will make us to go to, through God. We need to know which kind of a prayer that we can represent ourselves to go through God. You know, there's prayers. We have, we have so many types, different types of prayers. As this season is ending here, whereby we need to appreciate God and thanks God and give thanks and honor. We, we need a, a, want to appreciate, like the sister said, we want to give God thanks and honor. That's one way to get access to God direct. When we do the praise and worship, miracles will, will continue flowing us. Yesterday we were looking in a scripture whereby a man of God, a, a, a king, was sick, having Cecilia a sick mental challenge and they were singing to the king they called the the music and then the, the little boy David was praying for the the king the king was 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 healed through praise and worship just pray, pray singing just prayer praise and worship singing a song and the king was healed therefore thanks thanksgiving and praise it is an it is another ex access uh, uh, access to get direct to God. It is a, another ex uh, uh, access. It is another ex uh, access to get it direct to God. When you look at the scripture from the book of Psalms one hundred four to five, Psalms one hundred four to five. Go ahead, sister. Psalms 104 to 5. Lord. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Psalms 100, verse 4. And to enter 5, yes. Into his gates with, enter into his gates with thanksgiving and to his courts with praise. Yes. Be thankful to him and bless his name. Yes. For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endures to all generations. Yes. Thanks, thanksgiving and praise. Enter his gates with the thanksgiving, with the thanksgiving. Uh, that's how you, we enter. 
That's one gate. Please unmute your phone. Unmute your phone. Yes, hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Jesus, we thank you. Lord, we bless your name. Enter its gates with thanks, thanksgiving, and its courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. The gates to enter is thanks and giving. The gates to enter direct to God, to heaven, is the gate of thanks and giving. That's the gate that we need to go. You know, the, the Bible is very clear saying, enter its gates with thanks giving. That is the gate to enter to heaven. That is one way of access. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. We thank God. Yes, God, my Father, in the name of Jesus. Enter his gates with thanksgiving. That is access, access key to enter. Thanksgiving is, a, is, an, is, a, is access, is a code number. That is an access code. Thanksgiving. When I was looking this scripture in love, I said, wow, this is really the key. Thanks, when we, we give thanksgiving to God, it is an a, 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 a access code to enter in heaven. In the book of, uh, as, as we read the book of uh, Ephesians, Ephesians 2 verse 18, which says, he came and preached, he, uh, let's start, start from, let's look at verse 17. He came and preached peace to you who were far away and peace to those who were near. Verse 18, for through him we both have access to the Father by one spirit. Now here, the, 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 through him, through the spirit, that is another key to enter to heaven, to enter to the Father direct. Therefore, now the most key here is the key called thanks and thanksgiving. Now this thanksgiving is the gates of entering to heaven. Enter to God. Enter to the throne of God. That's why thanksgiving is very important. Hallelujah. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thanksgiving is very important. This is teaching. This is teaching. I'm, I'm trying to show you something here. You must learn how to give thanks and, 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 and the giving. Thanks and, you know, thanks and giving. Give back what God has blessed you. We have to appreciate him. We have to praise him. You know, here I said, thanksgiving and his courts with praise. So thanksgiving, thanksgiving and praise. Give thanks to him and praise to his name. You know, there are so many words here. One, number one, give thanks. Number two, praise. Number three, again, they repeat praise. You see? Which means is 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 stressing that we have to praise God, uh, give God thanks, and praise Him, give God thanks and praise Him. That is the the key entry to to heaven. When you are in anywhere where you are, you should learn how to give God thanks and giving, thanks and giving and praise Him. We need to praise him, we need to thank him, we need to honor him, we need to appreciate him, we need to sing for him and, and honor him. For the Lord is good and his mercy endure forever. His faithfulness continue through all generations. You know, he is good. God is good. His, his faithfulness continue throughout the whole, the whole generation. God has never failed. God, is, God, God loves us. That's why his love. The Lord is good. God is so good and His love endure forever. His love endure forever. God loves us. Because God loves us, we love Him back. If we don't love God, then God cannot love us. His love endure forever for those who love Him. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you, Father. Lord, I thank you, Father. Now, when you look at that scripture, you see, you see, like the Bible is, is, is clearly telling us that Lord, our God is so faithful. He conti continues 
through all generation there is no way that god will, will will refuse to be good to you or to your generation the generation who does not worship god god cannot be their god as long as you worship the lady god the god of abraham isaac and jacob our god is good a good god and that is the access god he has given to us direct we can go to him without anything hindering us we don't have to pass through anybody we have to pass we have to go direct to him and it's helpful because of his love his, his love for us endure forever to all generation now you can we, we are going to look another another scripture here there was a jesus heals 10 men with the leprosy the bible says in the book of luke luke 17 verse 11 to 19 luke 17 verse 11 to 19 the bible says uh, sister go ahead somebody unmute your phone please yes Luke 17, verse 11 to 19. 19. Yes, yes. Now it happened as he went to Jerusalem that he passed through the midst of Samaria and Galilee. Then as he entered a certain village, there met him ten men who were lepers, who stood afar off. And they lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. So when he saw them, he said to them, Go show yourselves to the priests. And so it was that as they went, they were cleansed. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, returned and with a loud voice glorified God and fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks. And he was a Samaritan. So Jesus answered and said, where, Were there not ten cleansed? But where are the nine? Were there not any found who returned to give glory to God except this foreigner? And he said to him, Arise, go your way. Your faith has made you well. Amen. Amen. You know, here, verse 18, look at that verse 18. Ten people from distance, they saw Jesus they cried to, to Jesus. They requested Jesus, please help us, heal us. Jesus said, okay, you are healed. Now, one of them who was a foreigner, the Bible is good because <laughs> he's saying a foreigner, a Samaritan, came back and give thanks to God. You see? And what happened to that? The, the other people, they left. Now, when they, they, they went, they didn't come back to give thanks. That is wrong. That man recognized. That man, this, the fallen man recognized. You can see what happened there. Uh, when the, Jesus healed them, the distance, distance beggars who, who requested him. Jesus is so good. Yeah? These people, they didn't have a key. They didn't have ex, uh, access God to, to go to get their healing. But now they got Jesus the son of God, and they, they, they call him from a distance. Now Jesus said, because your faith has healed you, be healed. And they, they, they were healed and they went away. They didn't come back. But the fallen one, the Samaritan, the Samaritan fallen, is the one who came back to give thanks. So he was recognized here in the heart and in heaven. So when you give thanks, when you come back to give thanks like this and, and here, coming, you are, your thanks will be recognized. You will get a direct access to heaven. That is how it is. Amen. It will be recognized. Amen. It is going to be recognized from heaven, here on heart and heaven. That's how this man, his thanks was recognized after coming back to give God thanks. Some people, they, they see miracles. I see people, they come here. You know, they, this, this, they, this, these are criminals. They were criminals. Everywhere there's criminals. Some people, they do that criminal, criminality everywhere. Jesus healed them. They didn't pay anything. 
instead of coming back and give thanks and testimony, they fly away because they got healed. But the foreigner who was not recognized, he, he made the history, he was recognized on heart and heaven. Now those one, the, the, the one who, 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 who think that they, they belong to Jesus, they are a Christian, and yet they, are, they were not recognized. And the devil, the devil who gave them that sickness, is, he didn't go anywhere. He is within. So he would go back to them again. And it would be very difficult for them again to get that healing. That's how it is. Now they fallen and recognized from, from here on earth. Once you know how to give God thanks and giving, you will be recognized. Because God, our God recognized that literal thanks and giving. Give God your thanks. Give God thanks. Uh, plant a special seed for your thanks and giving. As we are preparing to end the, 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 the year, prepare a special seed of giving God thanks and, and giving to Him. You say, God, thank you. Thank you that you have been taking care of me. Thank you, Lord, that you are a God. Thank you, Lord, for, uh, for, for what you have done for me January up to now. You, we give thanks. We, we give thanks, and here is my seed. I am giving you this to honor you and thank you. So that when you, when you do that, God will recognize you. You will be recognized. Not because the pastor needs your seed. No, it is biblical. It is, that is, that, that is how you can get a direct access to God. Hallelujah. I'm going to pray. I'm going to pray for you. Hallelujah, Jesus. My God, my Father, oh God, I thank you for all your goodness, mercy, and the compassion so shown to us, us in the name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you, Lord. Amen. I want to thank you, Father. Father, I thank you. I thank you, Lord. I thank you for you, all your goodness, mercy, and the compassion shown to us, us in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you. Amen. Thank you for sowing your soul, soul for part of us. Uh, Father, thank you. Thank you for saving our souls from the path of destru destruction in Jesus' name. Father God, I thank you, Father. I thank you, Lord. The anointing of praising God shall never run dry in our mouth in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you. Lord, I pray that the anointing of praise and the worshiping God will, shall never run dry in our mouth, God. Lord, fill us with, your, with the words. Fill us, God, my Father anoint us God let you anoint flow in our mouth so that we can be able to give thanks and honor and praise you and glorify your name in the mighty name of Jesus Lord we thank you oh Lord we thank you for all the blessings of life that you have given to us God Lord my father our soul rest up and press your, your maker let let our soul rest up and press our maker in the mighty name of Jesus our soul rest up and press our maker let us bless our maker in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. We bless you. We lift your name of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Our souls rest up and bless our maker. We gonna maker. We love you, Jesus. We love you, God. We glorify your name. We acknowledge you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, we acknowledge your name in the name of Jesus. Only in the house of God and all our hearts shall praise him in the mighty name of Jesus. We shall praise you, God. We shall give you all the glory, Jesus. Everlasting thanksgiving. Everlasting thanksgiving. Process every area of our life in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. We thank you, Lord, for giving us testimony, that glorifying your name in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, we thank you, Father. We acknowledge your name. We thank you, Lord, for not making things difficult for us in the mighty name of Jesus. We all, oh God, we thank you because your name shall never be be for, shall, shall forever be present in, in our life in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh yes, Lord, we thank you. Amen. Lord, we bless your name, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, we thank you Amen. because your name shall never, shall forever shall press in your life. It shall press. We shall press you, Lord, my Father, in the name of Jesus. We shall press you. We will never Amen. be silenced. We will never be tried in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we press you. Amen. We give all the glory, Jesus. 
thank you, thank you, Lord. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father, empower us to continue and prevail in the prayers. In the name of Jesus, empower us, God. Empower us, God. Empower us. We need your empowerment. We need to empower us, God. Father, empower us to continue and prevail in prayers, God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, God, my Father. Lord Almighty. Lord, we kind your presence, your precious holy and the purif purifying fire. In the name of Jesus, Spirit of God, throw near us to renew and intimacy, intimacy, relationship with you and for now, in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah, God Almighty, we thank you, Father, oh God, revive us in every area of our life, in the mighty name of Jesus, oh Lord my God, revive us, every area of our life, we need to revival, we need to revival Jesus, we, we need to revival God, revive us every area, where we are, where we are tried, where we are not doing well, in in our prayers, God, in our leading, God, in our fasting, God, revive us, fill us, God, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father God, teach us how to, to reach your heart daily and receive for, from you all the blessings you have in store for us, in the mighty name of Jesus, oh my God, my Father, Amen. teach us, God, teach us, Lord, teach us, my God and my Father, Holy Spirit, teach us, Holy Spirit, guide us, Holy Spirit, fill us more, in the mighty name of Jesus. We receive, we receive the power of God to move forward in the name of Jesus. Receive the power of God to move forward, God, in the name of Jesus. Receive the power of God to move forward in every area in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Receive power to move forward. In the mighty name of Jesus, Araba Shatter or Abakuraba, Rabba Bashata, you shall not die but live to fulfill our to fulfill God's given the destiny in your life in Jesus' name. We shall not die. You shall not die. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, we declare by the degree of heaven, in the mighty name of Jesus, we shall not die. We shall live and declare the, 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 the word of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, my God. Amen. By the power of the Holy Spirit, we are delivered from every financial bondage in the mighty name of Jesus. My God and my Father, by the power of the Holy Spirit, we are delivered from every financial bondage in the mighty name of Jesus. My God, my Father, I set you free from bondage of failure, sickness, poverty, and time return in the mighty name of Jesus. Lack of failure at the gate of success in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, all of us, Shakara, Bashatara, Rabakuria, Robaba, Shatara, and a sickness, diseases formed by the enemy, and a sickness fired by the enemy. I destroy them, I bind them. Lord, as we thank you, Father, as we thank, as we come before, before your presence to honor you and thank you, Jesus, I destroy and bind out every spirit of sickness and diseases, every infirmity in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I thank you. Lord, I thank you. In the mighty name of Jesus, every power trying, trying you down, trapping you down. Let them be be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Every curses pronounce against pronounce against your destiny. I command them to be broken into pieces, to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Every curses militaring against your prosperity and fulfillment of your goals be destroyed, be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Every object fashioned against your life and your family be frustrated, be frustrated in the name of. Jesus, any power sign to manage it to hinder and cast your prosperity. I command them to die, to die in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, I destroy ever, ever I destroy you from the life of circle of failure, disappointment, uh, sickness, and frustration in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. I destroy the powers. The, the enemies that make you uh, circle, that make you to be to fail, that make you to be frustrated, that make you to be disappointed. I destroy you, the enemy. You are a liar. Get out of these people. Get out of the person. Get out of from this woman. Get out from this man. Use the 
demon of frustration, the demon of, uh, of, of disappointment. I cast you out in the mighty name of Jesus. I list the people of God Amen. to run out to give thanks and giving, to praise you, to thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord, Father, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you. We thank you, Father. Every curses operating in your family line, I break them. I break them in the mighty name of Jesus. Every curses operating in your family bloodline, let them be broken. I break them. I destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you. Jesus, I give you the glory. Oh, my God, King of glory. Jesus, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Father God, thank every curses you brought upon us. You brought upon us every curses that we can we brought upon us. Every curses, there's some curses you can bring by yourself. There's a curses that God can bring to you. There's curses people can bring to you. Every curses, I curse them, I break them, I destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. My God and my Father, in the name of Jesus, destroy every curse in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father, there's curses that you can bless on your on your family line. The curses that you will never let you to give thanks and 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 giving like what the, the, the nine people who were healed, the ten were healed nine did not come and show up they went away but one came back, that was an curse blessed on them, they, they are the curses that blessed on people, they don't know how to give thanks, they can never say thanks, they can never appreciate, that is a curse many people are like that, you are looking be, behind and say, why is it this person did not even say thank you thank you People are cursed and doomed. They cannot say thank you. But because God of, he said he's a massive God. He's a faithful man. He is God. He is God our God. He will help us and break every curse and break every everything that is hindering us from saying thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we bless your name. We give all the glory, Jesus. Hallelujah. I destroyed by fire every pandering the enemy has marked down for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Let them be destroyed. Let them be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. Rabba Baba Shato. Rabba Baba Shata. Riba Baba Shakaraba. Robo Baba Shoto. Yes, Lord. I break and destroy every evil, every works of the enemy, working with the Satan against your life, against your children. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare prophetically, receive double portion blessings in the, in, in the exchange of shame and delay in the mighty name of Jesus. I prophesy, I prophesy, prophetically prophesy, receive double portion blessings, exchange of shame and delay in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, receive your double blessings, receive your Amen. double portion blessings in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh yes, yes Lord, every curse that you brought into your life through disobedience and ignorance, I break by fire, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire. You know, ignorance is a bad disease. Ignorance is an enemy, it's a great enemy. You can bring ignorance because of ignorance and disobedience, you can bring curses by your own by yourself. Therefore, any curses that you brought by disobedience or ignorance, I break them, I destroy them, I cast them, I let them powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father. Lord, I thank you. Every unspoken curses against your life, against your family, and your business, break in the name of Jesus. 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 My God and my Father, I want to thank you, Father. This is thanks and giving. We thank you, Lord. We give all the glory. We give all the honor in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. God, we magnify your name. We give you thanks, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord, we acknowledge your name. We give thanks, God. Let's open your mouth and thank God and thank God. Hallelujah. We give you thanks, God. We give you all our love, God. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Lord.
I want to give you the glory. I give you honor. I bless you. I thank you, Jesus. You are wonderful. You are worth of God, King of glory, King of kings. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. My God and my Father, I want to honor you, God. I want to thank you, Jesus. I want to pray for everyone of you that God will release the blessings into your life in Jesus' name. The blessings of thanks and giving. The blessing of appreciation. The blessing that it will move you forward in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I thank you. I thank you, Jesus, you. in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, we thank you. Yes. As we are going to end this year, this month, you have to release yourself. Some people, there's somebody that is holding somebody because of what he did to you. You have tried to forgive that person you, you can't forgive. God says that you have to forgive that person. Release that person, your miracle is coming. Just leave it, leave it, leave it. Yes, it was bad, but you tried to forgive, but it comes back again. When it comes, you feel so bad, you hold it. Release it. Remember the Bible said, don't let the sun go down. You, sons has gone down. Ears has gone down. That thing is killing you. That thing is frustrating you. Let it go. Yes, let it go now in Jesus' name. Some of the sickness that is in your body right now, it is because of unforgiveness. Just forgive the person and let it go. Let it, you will see in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, we thank God. I thank God that God is, he has seen you, you. He has seen your cry in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. I give you all the glory. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. I want to thank you for everyone. We will meet here tomorrow, 9 a.m. 9 a.m. tomorrow, Eastern, Cent uh, Eastern Time. And this is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Sik, saying bye-bye. Bye-bye, see you tomorrow, 9 a.m. And tomorrow night, yes? You want to say something? Yes, thank you, thank you. Who is that? <laughs> yes, I love you too. You know, I can't miss to say I love you and there's nothing I can do about it. You know I love you. <laughs> yes, thank you, thank you so much. God bless you. Have a wonderful time. Amen. Yeah, Goodbye. so tomorrow, tomorrow 9 p.m. we are on again. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful time. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. 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 <laughs> bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs>